I release fire here again with more Immortals Phoenix Rising. So I'm going to talk you through elements of the Atalanta Corrupted Hero, mainly because it's very specific and you've got to do certain things. So hopefully the video is going to help you out. If it does, drop me a like below. But you're going to need godly powers to be able to make it through Atalanta, the Corrupted Hero. And the first you're going to need is for the Arrows of Apollo, because you're going to need to be able to slow them down to be able to make it around all of these loops. Now, I actually did this first one on normal speed the very first time I entered here. So you can get away with trying to like scam them, but the later ones are gonna get way tougher. So you definitely need the ability to speed up and slow down your arrows, mostly to slow them down to be able to make the turns. So in Godly Powers, what you're actually looking for is this position control. So you will need to get some coins to be able to unlock that. And you get those by taking on Godly Challenges, like the Palace of Aphrodite constellation, which you can see linked above. And then you should be able to see how the rest of the puzzles go. And then I'll pick up with you with more tips on how to beat Atalanta when it gets to that section a little bit later. Okay, so now you've made it through all of the Arrows of Apollo puzzles and made it to the top. You've got Atalanta, the corrupted hero to face, and she's got a killer bear with her. So you need to take out the bear first, really, and ideally you need a few godly powers to do that. Ares' Wrath will give you a huge chunk of stun damage, and then you can use your axe to be able to stun it, and then as soon as the bear is stunned, position yourself behind the bear with Atalanta on the other side, and then you can do lots of damage with your normal attack to build up enough stamina to be able to keep on unleashing other attacks, like Ares' Wrath again, to be able to build up another stun, or if I start his hammer to be able to do some huge damage. However, there's a couple of things to take into account. And the first of those is that, as you can see there, Atlanta has an unstoppable arrow shot, which fires in red. If she gets you with that, it'll go through the bear and get you no matter where you position yourself. And the second thing to be aware of is that it's a good idea to use Phosphor's attacks to be able to do some extra damage to the bear. And also, if you've got it equipped, you can use Phosphor's health boost to be able to give yourself a little bit more health 
each time it hits. And that'll save you from using too many potions. And then if you cycle, rinse, repeat all of that, that should see you finishing off the bear and just having Atalanta to face. But I'm gonna leave you with the rest of the fight with the bear of Atalanta so you can see exactly how I managed to finish it off. And then I'll pick back up when it's just Atalanta left and I'll give you some more tips on how to finish her off. Okay, so now that you've just got Atalanta Corrupted Hero to take on and the bear is done, it's a similar situation as before where you can use Ares' Wrath to build up a huge amount of stun each time and then just dodge out of the way. But you do need to build up your stamina to be able to unleash those moves. So you do need to get in close and use Phosphor's attacks to be able to build up your stamina a little bit every now and again. So you can parry her shots as well. But the best thing to do is to get in close, get in a few hits, get out of the way, and then use your godly powers to keep building ever closer to the stun. And as soon as you get the stun, that's when you get a chance to unleash the most damage. So again, just dodge out of a way of her unstoppable red shots. Try to use Phosphor's attacks, and you can see, because I managed to dodge out of the way of that, I had enough stamina to be able to get in and do Ares' Wrath, which stunned her, and then just unleashed everything that I had. So I used a potion as well. I used an attack potion just to give me some extra attack. And then again, just try to cycle, rinse, repeat all of that. And that's how to beat Atalanta Corrupted Hero. Like I said before, hopefully the video helps you out. If it does, drop me a like below. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Leave any comments. Let me know how you get on against Atalanta's Corrupted Hero. And I will catch you next time.
booted Atalanta couldn't outrun Phoenix's weapon, but now her spirit could run free.